guys, it's Kristen here with a pregnancy vlog. What? <laughs> Wyatt's here too and he'll probably do some talking. It's been quite some time since we, we, I did a pregnancy vlog and really I haven't had much interest in filming them. My pregnancy has been very uneventful, thank goodness. Um, but we did announce several weeks ago the gender And if you've been watching my other vlogs, you probably already realized that we are having a girl. What? Um, I still can't believe it. We haven't even really done much shopping yet. Wyatt, come back here. Come here. He loves to go in Logan's room and wake him up during his naps. So for today, I just used another template to answer um, questions to kind of try to cover everything. So the size of the baby, she, she, is about 13 and a half inches long, I think. Weight gain, for me, I, I'm probably getting close to 20 pounds so far. So, Wyatt, come here. Oh, I'm 25 weeks and a few days, 25 and a half, somewhere in there. So I've gained probably close to 20 pounds now. And my weight gain has been increasing. I've got to cut back on the sweets, you guys. Maternity clothes? Yeah, definitely every day. All day, every day, maternity clothes. Symptoms. Up until about 20 weeks, I really had almost no symptoms. Um, someone asked me at church one Sunday, how are you feeling? And I was like, why are they asking how I'm feeling? And I was like, oh yeah, I'm pregnant. Um, so my hips and my pelvis and my pubic bone have been hurting so bad. It started around probably 22 weeks and then Saturday we went to a birth fair and then visited my husband's grandfather and I think I was up and down a lot getting the boys out of trouble and I was really really sore on Sunday and then I think sitting in Sunday school and sitting in a pew kind of exacerbated what was already going on so I've been trying to take it easy this week and recover and then hopefully take better care of myself and probably just more exercise will help that so <laughs> hey um, so yeah exercise and trying to drink a ton of water which I'm failing at today of course I can never have two good days in a row of my water um, acid reflux started or probably around 22 weeks or so <sighs> nothing major but I have it just about every day um, I have been, as far as my pelvic pain, I have been wearing a belt from my midwife. I'm not wearing it right now, but I have been wearing it this morning, all morning, so that's good. And it, it really, really helps when I can remember to wear it diligently. Um, let's see. I've been taking uh, Floridix, which is an iron supplement, and Femdophilus, which is for vaginal flora health. Just to help with your group B strip test, I think. I'm really, really informative here. Cravings and aversions, nothing specific. I always just want, you know, quote, something good. And I never know what it is, and it drives me insane. I tell people I just wish I could have a clear craving. I don't care if it was, you know, carrot sticks. If I could just crave something specific, it would be awesome. Um, no aversions, though, thank goodness. Movement, yeah, she is a mover. We're gotten to the point now where you can see like my belly moving around and my husband puts his hand there and he's like, whoa. I think it blows his mind every time with the, all the movement that the babies do inside. Wyatt, come here, come here. He loves to wake up, brother. Sleep, sleep has been pretty good. Um, when I was in my pain level on Saturday night and Sunday and Monday around that time, um, it was kind of hard to sleep, but I have a snoogle, which definitely helps, and Wyatt has been sleeping really, really well as of late. He, um, sometimes he'll get up in the middle of the night, but usually he gets up just once right around six, kind of either side of six, and then he goes back down for a little bit, generally. Sometimes I'll sleep till like 6.30 and then just be up for the day. But usually it's a, you know, 5.50, somewhere in there. A quick little snack. Um, 
speaking of Wyatt and getting up and nursing, he is still nursing about, just about four times every day. Sometimes, you know, more, but usually just um, that earlier morning snack, and then he nurses uh, before his morning nap, before his afternoon nap, and before bedtime. And the other snacking has really kind of, kind of slowed down and stopped, so. He doesn't ask for it much, but he does enjoy it when he gets it. If he were to ask for it, I, yeah, I have no problem with that. Yeah. Yeah. He's usually too busy to slow down and nurse. Um, the name. We have picked out a name. It is official. We have told our family and Logan, which really settles it, but I'm not ready to share yet. so. Just know that yes, we have picked a name and I'm very excited about it. It's very it's very southern and it takes from my side of the family and his side of the family and it's just perfect because Logan's middle name is my maiden name, which I love because Matt's ma why come back. Uh, my husband's middle name is his his mother's maiden name. So I love that. And then Wyatt's middle name is Matt's father's name, so for our third, we chose from each side, and it's just, it's very special. Let's see, I'm going to have my glucose test next week. I have a mid appointment on Tuesday. And other than that, I can't think of anything else to share as far as pregnancy. Um, oh, Logan, you scared me. <laughs> you okay? And you scared me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Woo! So... I want to know, what do you want to see in pregnancy vlogs? What do you look for when you watch a pregnancy vlog? What do you want to know about my pregnancy or just in general? I would love to answer any questions. I'll try to insert a quick belly shot. I'm getting big out there. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. All right, here is my belly at 25. <coughs> 25 in a few days pregnant. Here I am. Just uh, I think the other day I used the phrase, my love handles are out of control. So, gotta cut back on the snacks. Or just the sweets, really. Oh gosh, my sweet tooth is terrible. So, here she is. Our little girl.